Assalamu alaikum. This is the uh, second part of uh, our tutorial. Now we're going to do a live demonstration of uh, the direct ophthalmoscopy. So uh, go back again. This is the green button. You just uh, flip the roller around a half a flip in order to open up the light. And then uh, you try to look through the hole. Okay? And this is actually what you do it. How you do it? Nine and a half degrees. Tama. So what you are doing is you check the uh, red reflex. It's very important to do three things. First of all, dim the light in order to get maximum dilatation. You ask the patient to look far away, okay? And uh, try to relax your accommodation. These are the all the major three steps that you have to do before. Uh, doing the thing um, now because of uh, you know for the purpose of this video we're not gonna dim the room but we're gonna ask uh, our madam here just to look far away okay Okay, so that's the first part. This is the red reflex. You go inside, and voila. Now you can see the optic nerve. Great. Okay, now <clears throat> always when you're examining, examine the right eye with the right eye, the left eye with the left eye. Otherwise, your face will go in touch with the patient's face, which is very uncomfortable for patients. That's one thing. Second thing, <clears throat> uh, try to hold your breath while uh, being in contact with the patient for many reasons. Some patients are uh, hospitalized in ICU. Some patients might have a communicable disease. Also, some patients might feel uh, very offended because of your breath. So uh, try your best to hold your breath when you are uh, very near to the patient. Now, uh, when you are checking the fundus, <clears throat> first of all, uh, you follow the blood vessels and then the blood vessels all get in touch together, uh, or let's say they communicate all in the central retinal artery. Uh, at that point, you are actually looking at the optic nerve. Now, we look at the ma uh, demarcation of uh, the, uh, the optic nerve uh, borders also you have to look at the blood vessels uh, there are two blood types of blood vessels that you will be seeing the first one is the artery which is faint red or let's say pinkish in color and we have the deep red the vein usually the vein is larger uh, uh, is larger than the artery by uh, let's say uh, um, over ratio of two to three or a ratio of uh, one to two, this is actually the usual. If you have severe constriction of the artery, this might indicate disease, such as uh, hypertension, for example, uh, patients with um, uh, diabetes or patients taking drugs that will constrict the uh, blood vessels. And thank you so much for uh, staying.